Elsewhere, a man has been found guilty of murdering his adopted daughter. 31-year-old Matthew Scully Hicks had denied causing catastrophic injuries to Elsie Scully Hicks, who died aged 18 months in May last year. Sky's Becky Williams has been following the case and joins us live from Cardiff Crown Court. Uh, Becky, what did the court hear? Well, it's been a desperately sad case, this. In the last hour or so, Matthew Scully Hicks has been found guilty of killing his adoptive daughter. As you say, she was just 18 months old, little Elsie. And we heard how she suffered a torrent of abuse, really, over her very short life. Uh, she suffered several injuries in the lead-up to her death, but on that night in question, uh, she suffered a bleed to the brain, a fractured skull. She also broke some of her ribs. And, like I say, in the lead-up, she had suffered other injuries. In fact, two months before her death, she fell down the stairs in the family home, and Matthew Scully Hicks said that happened because he'd left the baby gate open. Uh, so, following that, he decided to call 999, and we can listen to a bit of that call. I was just changing my daughter for bed, and then she went all floppy and limp, and now she's just not, she's not doing anything. She's lying on the floor. OK, you with her now, sir? I am. How old's your daughter? Um, she's 18 months. OK, is she awake? No. Is she breathing? No. Now, throughout this case, we've heard from neighbours who said they heard on regular occasions Matthew Scully Hicks screaming and shouting, even swearing at little Elsie. We've heard evidence that it was likely he violently shook her and that was ultimately what caused her death in May 2016. We've also been read several text messages that Matthew Scully Hicks sent not only to his husband, Craig, but also uh, to a friend. And in those messages, he refers to Elsie as both Satan and a diva. I want to read you a few of these. The first one to his husband, Craig, and he said, I'm going through hell with Elsie. Mealtimes and bedtimes are like my worst nightmare at the minute. She's been up here screaming for 10 minutes non-stop. Another one, he said, honestly, she is Satan dressed up in a baby grow. In bed, half a bottle, just about, and scream through it all again. And then finally, one to his friend uh, in September 2015. He said, Elsie has had two nights of being Satan before bed, which ain't fun. Now, like I say, little Elsie died uh, last year at the end of May. She was taken to hospital here in Cardiff, and it was there that she sadly died. But in the last hour or so, Matthew Scully Hicks has been found guilty of her murder. He is likely to serve a very long sentence indeed. Uh, in fact, the sentencing will be back here at Cardiff Crown Court first thing tomorrow. But in the public gallery today, when the verdict was announced, uh, there were a lot of tears from his family members and certainly Matthew Scully Hicks looked very shocked uh, with his head bowed. Becky, thanks very much.